Hello, and welcome back to Coin Lady Channel. Today, June 25th, is an important date. The 1st of July is rapidly approaching. Really, I am. I anticipate your enthusiasm, too. The conclusion of this lawsuit is imminent. There's a limit to how long this can go on. But Judge Torres has been sitting comfortably on her throne, writing the final documents that will finally settle this Ripple vs. SEC case. Expect it. The best part is that it might all happen at any time. At any given time. We can see things more clearly, and XRP's ascent towards the Holy Grail may begin. Here's a little update on the Bermuda Triangle, $27 for XRP, that we'll discuss. We'll be discussing the repercussions in Brazil and the ECB's ties a bit later on in this video. Furthermore, take note of who is advocating for a rising market. Yeah. You're not going to believe this. Stop what you're doing and take a seat. Okay, let's dive in. Bitcoin is presently trading at $31,828, a rise of 2.01% in the last 24 hours. Ethereum is trading at $1,907, an increase of 1.19% in the last 24 hours. Both the USDC and the USD arrived at their dollar exchange rates. The XRP slash USD exchange rate has remained stable at 0.497, just around the target level of 49.5. In the previous day, it has decreased by 0.17%. What, though? On an hourly basis, the market valuation of all cryptocurrencies is going up by 0.37%, reaching a total of $1.2 trillion, just as Bitcoin approaches 49.68%. The following step from here is easy to understand. When Bitcoin's dominance grows, so does its value. 40 to 42k, I've been shouting it from the rooftops since the beginning of the year. I told you it would be finished by August. Things are moving in that direction. This is actually occurring. Hurry up and fasten your seatbelts. If you are unfamiliar with Lux Lines, we will be holding an auction tomorrow at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You should definitely sign up for Discord. 10 primary product lines are being released. The great thing about these 10 is that in addition to the NFT, you also receive a head with a similar profile and there will be two separate systems of incentives in place. This product line is being introduced on the Korean blockchain as you may know. We were among the first group of 10 projects that Reza welcomed to Mint. You may recognize him from Sologenic, but you'll get more than X or P for these. Every month, you'll also get some of your aquarium money back. You get two NFTs for one prize. Another example. This is a personal essay. You can get 7 points for each of these. There's a retrofuturist feel to this. Then the famous moon landing photo was released. There's been a lot of chatter about this one in the Discord server. There will be a lot of heat. Look at all this fighting. It's impossible to predict how things will develop. That's one of the auction's many advantages. Prices do not begin at any given point. This was published by Crypto Insights. Brazil, a tremor. Take a look. After mentioning Montenegro and how to collaborate on digital currencies, he goes weird how Ripple just, you know, slyly mentioned Brazil in a recent tweet. Remember that I've been waving the flags of three countries for a long time. Is Brazil prepping an announcement? The May 31st, 2018 issue of Blockworks is shown here. We have made a solid commitment to planning ourselves at the forefront of crypto technology, says the UK's Minister of Finance. What crypto analysis said I'm keeping a watch on Brazil, India, and the UK, all of which are big ripple markets with established on-demand liquidity. But there's something important I don't want you to overlook. Ripple held a closed-door meeting with Brazilian government leaders and central bankers. What do you think motivated them to act in that way? and Azel adds his two cents. He then adds, that is certainly possible. There appears to be activity occurring off stage. That article I mentioned can be found here. Date, Wednesday, June 3rd. 
In a meeting behind closed doors three years ago, central bankers in Brazil discussed long-standing institutional issues. Put up a job ad in São Paulo, Brazil, for Ripple, seeking a partner to act as director of solutions for central banks. What do you anticipate will happen next? In 2022, on August 18, Brazil will soon have access to crypto-enabled payment solutions thanks to a partnership between Ripple and Travelix Banks. The first financial institution to adopt XRP was Travelix Bank. They've departed from Brazil. Money exchanges for travelers. Our fully digital, fully personalized bank. The Central Bank of Brazil will license and oversee the first foreign exchange bank in the country. Pay attention to the deals. We embrace technology so that we can provide the best services to customers of all sizes and in a wide range of industries. In 2017, 2018 saw the debut of the WooHooHoo. Hoo. It was during this time that Joel Katz joined the Discord and was asked his prediction for the following corridor. The question was posed earlier. On-demand liquidity, or XRP, will be the currency of choice for the peso in Mexico and the Philippines. Now. Did you hear what Joel Katz had to say? Brazil. Since 2017 to 2018, Ripple has been collaborating with Brazilian institutions. A position in a central bank was advertised. Online money. Creator, driver, and head of technology. We have moved to more private sessions. In a recent tweet regarding digital currencies issued by central banks, Ripple referenced Brazil. The Brazilian central bank will soon be established. That was first reported on by us. The XRP Cryptosystem Wolf published it. Christine Lagarde, head of the European Central Bank, recalls meeting former Ripple advisor Michael Barr. Up on stage is Brad Garlinghouse, and in the spotlight is Christine Lagarde. She led them in at the BIS Augustin, Carstens' front door. One can see, from left to right, the chairman of the Saudi Arabian Monetary Authority, the chief executive of the Hong Kong Monetary Authority, and the IMF's director of monetary markets. That's not meaningless. Brad Garlinghouse is up there for a reason. Christine Lagarde, the IMF's managing director, and the BIS's director general are both present for a good reason. Take a look at their recent efforts, focus, and announcements, which are all related to central bank digital money. I seem to recall that Brad was questioned about this. There have been bank runs, but someone wondered what an XRP run would look like. In what form would Ripple then exist? Well, Ripple isn't a run on a firm, Brian remarked. And he says, I just couldn't imagine what a run on XRP would look like. I don't see how that's doable. We need to find you an interview. I've got to entertain you. Well. Okay, Charlie finally speaks up. And what do you know? Morgan Creek Capital's Mark Yesko. He claimed to be Bitcoin's creator. In addition, the cryptocurrency markets have officially launched an upward trend. Is this person just like Jim Cramer? Do we give up now, or do we take your word as gods? No, I don't think we're ready to be bullish just yet. If you missed the second video where I dated back to 2012 and showed you the chart, you know what I'm talking about and where I stand come November. It looks back to every having since 2012, plots out where we are right now, and predicts that this whole thing will begin in November like clockwork. Bitcoin's upward trend begins in November. Since 2012, the numbers have been spot on. Folks. Do you seriously believe that all of a sudden it will drastically alter? Not. No way. No decision has been made on X or P as of November. You know what though? Since the ruling or outcome of the lawsuit will only serve as a multiplier on top of the price of X or P, the longer it can be delayed and the higher the price of X or P can go, the better off we will be in the near run. This A22 was completed by the library. I believe A2X was used. Maybe a tad bit greater. I forced him to increase X or P to its maximum level. The situation becomes more transparent after that. 
We go from point A to point X, so get us a six-pack as we approach the point where the price of Bitcoin will double. Then, we'll give you an update on the Bermuda Triangle before moving on to discuss the newly added targets on the board. The aim now shifts to this. Looking is the topic we'll be discussing. Get ready to spend as much as $27 crypto. Please provide the revised chart as soon as possible, as it refers readers to my favorite piece, published on May 1, 2023, which has detailed macro and micro rules for XRP. Here's the latest version of the Bermuda Triangle. A price of $27.60 will certify our departure from Bermuda's gravitational pull, as was previously stated and anticipated. Just another 10 cents and we'll have this sucker locked in at 77 cents or 80 cents. That's a barrier on a global scale. Therefore, if he can successfully close above it, he will have a solid foundation from which to propel himself towards his loftier goals. Since the Bermuda gravity is still stopping the bulls from slingshotting the market, the target range of 50 to 67 cents can be reached even by late August. So, people, we still have till roughly August to achieve any value between 50 cents and 67 cents. The $27 goal is still in the cards. The triangle also won't be simple. That can only be accomplished with exceptionally good news. It's hard to imagine more exciting news than Ripple. And the Brazilian central bank has said that they will be working together and using XRP. Is there any chance of the lawsuit being dropped? How about establishing some sort of order in the USA? Excellent news, indeed. How about relisting XRP on exchanges? What do you think about making XRP the default pairing on each of these trading platforms? All of these positive developments will serve as a driving force. If you need a visual aid for the graph, here it is. And this is what we are seeing. Here's another picture showing the yellow lines we're trying to cross. At this half dollar mark, we are engaged in combat with the first. The upcoming one will cost you 67 cents. If these incidents occur prior to August or even in that month, we should be prepared. Let's rewind to the beginning of the story, the blue ocean aim of $27 for XRP is rapidly approaching. Think about it. The Bermuda Triangle collapses, and XRP drops below $27. Do you have a plan for moving forward? Is there a way out? Do you have a plan for handling your money? How complete are your conversations? Can you handle this, folks? This option is not completely out of reach. Please like and subscribe as usual. See you in the next video, bye.